communities. <laughs> I'm going to laugh if you ask. I don't know if you guys are familiar with Jeremy Whitley, who does a lot of the writing on the comics. Um, he actually has his own creator series called Princeless, which is one of the greatest creator-owned comics out there. It's about a princess who gets tired of way young guys to save her. So she breaks out of her tower and she starts going to save princesses on her own. And this fall, he's put together a huge anthology, a fan anthology. Uh, Tony Fleece, who does the comics, has done a story. Just um, don't pay. Sombra son. Oh my god, there's... He's, he's reproducing. <laughs> That's awesome. You had to do, leave, don't ever talk to me or my son again. <laughs> yeah, we do. Sabre, what are you doing with Amy Larson's book? Hey, what the fuck? Just putting more on the camera. Jeez, man. Ladies and gentlemen, we are now on the road. I don't think I've heard you say ladies and gentlemen so far in this vlog. Yeah, don't worry. I said it at the very beginning. Yeah. Look at that airplane just turning. Look at the, the rims on that car. It looks wow. Strong, actually. Wow. Like wow. Wow. So we're here with Joe, and we've I've met Joe, it was at Cider Fest where we first met, I think, formally. Yes. Tell us about and, yourself, Joe. Yeah, tell us about Joe. Uh I am a custom car builder. I racer. Well, Joe, actually, he is a big fan of low budgets, which is, it makes my heart melt. Um, I love you, Joe. Uh, and he actually painted up his car as a low budget TV car, which we're totally honored about, so that's cool. And people can watch your races online. Yes, uh, twitch.tv slash lugnutshub. So we're on our way to Portillo's. Now, Portillo's, what is the thing to get at Portillo's? Port uh, over at Portillo's. Portillo's! Sorry, I forgot I was in the north. <laughs> you're, you're in Illinois, come on. If In Arizona, it's called Portillo's. Up here, it's called Portillo's. Is it, is it called Illinois? L. No, Illinois, because the, it's the, the, Thank you. Really? Yeah. Wow. Green flag! Green, <laughs> green, green! The thing to get at Portillo's, it is hot dogs, Italian beef, cheesy okay. beef. Just Cheesy just, beef? Yes, cheesy Italian beef. What the heck? This place apparently has Chicago dogs. Is that true? Now, is this is this where... It is perfectly acceptable to get it without pickles. Is it? Yes. It's not. Joe, thank you. Joe, it's not for you, boy, like. <laughs> I want to hear Flash do a stand-up comedy. <laughs> from uh, the sloth from Zootopia. Oh. No. No. <laughs> we all might be going to the movies tomorrow. Yeah. If we do, you should join us. Yes, yeah. sweet. Like, literally. Uh, it'll be my fifth time seeing Zootopia. <laughs> and I'm excited. I'm like... You like the two more than like Cars? Yeah, oh, yeah. Oh, Cars is one of my movies. favorites. I, I love... I, I mean, I still love Cars, don't get me wrong. What's... Well, what is... Because I've never seen you so excited about a movie, movie before. I, is, is I this... haven't seen myself this excited about a movie before. <laughs> I, I, I don't know. Is MLP? Rival that at all as far as how you're excited for that versus this? Like, I'm, I'm more have excited. I've been so excited about anything before in my life as far as like how cool. Never in my life have I been excited about anything. Like, Sarah's like. <laughs> 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 I'm Robin Schmerberg. <laughs> Robin Schmerberg. No, Bob. 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 Bob, Bob, Bob Rorman. Bob Rorman Schumberg. I wish the four wasn't even there. Like, just let it be this the Rob. Bob Rorman Schaub Schmerberg. Rob Rorman's. Romberg. What do they sell? I don't know. I want to go in. <laughs> they sell roars. I feel, I feel Bob compelled. I want to go. With, with Zootopia, there's just some about the movie, some about the characters that it's like, it reminds me kind of of when I rediscovered Chip and the Rescue Rangers, and I got so immersed into that. And because with M what the hell is this? Um, this is the line to get in. No, no. Yes. Why are there curbs? Why are there curbs? Median. Yeah, what the fuck? What I'm just gonna say because Illinois. Is, I'm gonna laugh if this actually isn't even a thing. Or no, you know what? Because Chicago. Thanks, I guess to I differentiate there, the differentiate. There are curbs in the middle of the road. There's what? curbs. Now, during <laughs> uh, around between the hours of 12 and 1:30, there would be a cop sitting there and actually stopping traffic that way and that way. This looks like a median that, that's being because this place is so busy. Yes. This is a We're gold, at the right place. If you open up a Portillo's, you opened up a gold mine. But here's the thing, though, is uh. Is this actually a median? Yes. Um, are the people <laughs> yeah, but, is this but, legal what we're doing right now? Yes. Oh. <laughs> I mean, if it's not, we're not going to tell. It's just on video, but... I haven't been pulled over for it once. I've never seen yeah. it before. No, so yeah, so, so we're all... It's kind of a little bit of a shock. It's like, huh. Figure eight! Oh! 
They made a point. Portillo, those. Portillo's. Yes. Portillo's. All right, I'm excited. So you got pasta and ribs over here. Pasta and ribs, and then you got all your hot dogs, beef, hot dogs. That's dog. where I'm yes. going. We got to do this. Portillo's beef hot dog with with no pickle, if that's possible. No pickle. We have our food. So I got an Italian thing, an Italian dog with cheese whiz. It was recommended to me by this guy. So if it's if it's crazy or weird, oh, oh my god, I'm already excited about this. <laughs> oh wow, I told you it was great. But before I get to that, I'm actually gonna start with the uh, the other guy here, which is just the regular Portillo hot dog. Now they don't call them Chicago dogs in Chicago. I guess that makes sense. All right. And look, look at that. No pickle. I saw a video one time. Yeah. But it's got tomatoes and sport peppers. I'm fine with both of those. I'm actually less of a fan of onions. But... Let's, good night. It's time to eat. What do you got? I got a cake shake. A cake shake? Milkshake. Hey, What's cake? No! <laughs> Take that, Paleo. That's all you're seeing. Oh, man. Mm, it's a cake shake. It's chocolate cake mixed up with um, a million milkshake. It's really good. It's like I'm drinking cake. I love it. You're drinking cake? Mm -hmm. God bless America. This is the epitome of human evolution. <laughs> You're a scientist. Have humans evolved? As if they could, but oh. they never asked if they should. Oh, they did. <laughs> It, it walk up, but walk up to like Galileo or Einstein, like I'm from the future. <laughs> what do you all have? Sip this. Yeah. <laughs> 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 he's, he's alive! <laughs> Alright folks, so we're back and uh, Saber's uh, gonna go goose hunting. Whoa, what's up? This this guy, we drove up and he just didn't oh, care. Or girl. Like a mate? What's up for goose poop? Ew! They're pretty, pretty animals. So that's what dinosaurs could be. Yes. What are you doing here? Where's your green card, Mr. Canadian Goose? Yeah. Oh. <laughs> He's not your pal, friend. I don't think don't want any poop either. He's not your pal, friend. Dude, don't worry about <laughs> <laughs> I wonder if she can report. Who cares about ponies when you guys got geese? <laughs> <Cigar. laughs> <laughs> Alright. So. Hey Lou. Hey. Hmm? Good to meet you, man. Hey, good to meet you. Ooh, good to meet you too, Saber. Hey. 